of other enemy types like the Charger or the Man of War. The Man of War is a massive ship capable of carrying over 100 cannons. These are ships that you really need to upgrade to be able to face. But now that this frigate has been demasted, we can start the boarding. Boarding, it's very important you are a pirate. This is how you gain cargo. This is how you take on ships. So here we can start the boarding from any orientation or angle we wish. The distance even matters. If you get too close, the two crews will just jump right into each other. If you start a bit further, you can jump in the water and go in for a sneak stealth attack. We have two objectives to accomplish for this boarding. We can take out the captain and we need to take out some of his crew. So using the swivel gun, we will efficiently take out a lot of the crew. And now we'll go for the captain using Edward's navigation abilities. Here again, using the new frame system, we have a dangerous enemy on the other side taking out our crew. We can easily take him out with a headshot. So what we see here is that two ships have come together to create this 3D environment where using your assassin abilities to navigate, to be stealthy, you can take the advantage and get the kill by surprise. Now that we've taken out the captain, we still need to take out a few of the crew members to complete this boarding. Now that we've plundered the ship, we're gonna gain that rum that we saw earlier, but we're also gonna gain an ammo and crew members and some gold. With every boarding, there's three options that you can do with that ship. You can gain crew members, you can send the ship to your fleet if you wish, or you can salvage a ship to repair the jackdaw if you took too much damage in the fight. In this case, since we did well, we're gonna send the ship to our fleet. Now that we're back in the Caribbean Sea, we needed to make sure that every minute